Hey guys, it's the Master Rotor Collector here to make hopefully a quick video of um I don't know if I'm gonna be correct with this, but this is kind of like this. It's um I think it's a tough trucks. So this is my I think it is tough trucks for Broncos. You see eleven there, that means two thousand eleven. Maybe that's when I got it, I don't know. Here's the battery compartment, made in China. And yeah, this thing's really cheap. Like I I know I got this when I was a little, it's a childhood item, but like these are made really cheap. Like, look at that bend right there. And if you, like, push the button and then you do like that, it'll kind of, like, make the audio kind of shaky. And it says made in China there. Just, like, it, like I found this in my basement being stored. I, it's supposed to come with a car. And I've seen these at places like Roses. I've seen these little things at Roses. I've seen this. I think I've seen the same exact one at Roses, like, many times. Like, many of them. And I've seen, like, the Camaros and the Corvettes there that say, like, the start your engines and play the same song as this and stuff. But, like, yeah, I've seen these cheap little cars like these at Roses. And Roses is, like, kind of like a Kmart. It's a really interesting little place. But, like, I've seen these things at Big Lots and I've seen these crappy little cars probably. And then some of these are sold at Walmart, too, but... Like, when I pulled this out of the basement, I just pulled it out because I thought it was a Bronco and I thought it was kind of cool. But I never knew that this trailer went with this. So that's pretty cool. I think it should come with some type of car in the back. But if somebody could tell me what the car looked like that came with it, that'd be nice. Because then I maybe could know what it's supposed to be and maybe then I could go find it. But um, I'd like to think this is a tough trucks vehicle. And yes, it did have corrosion, but I cleaned it out since it's been stored, you know. And I took the bags from this and put it in this. If you want to know the three sound effects that this button has, these buttons have. Yeah, they have the same sound effects. Now for this little Bronco, and oh my gosh, stupid F-150. Uh, here is my F-150 if you haven't seen it before in other videos. I get this st sticker. Um, I did the black dots here. If you haven't seen my customization videos, then you should go watch them and see it into detail. Here's the little black dots I did on these wheels here. And here's the custom wheel I made for it since it didn't have a rim. And that's why I did the black dots so it would match it. Here's this. I painted this. It looks kind of sloppy right there, but I don't know if I could ever fix that. Um, I, I painted this. I painted this. I painted the door handles painted these door handles. I think I repainted these for I have no idea reason. Um, I painted this little light right here. I painted this light. I painted this light. I painted this. Um, I painted the back window. And then I made it this little uh, crappy toolbox out of tin foil and cardboard. If you can see right here, it's like these little weird little string things right here. And it's glued down by some more tin foil. If you see, you know, you can like open and close it open and close it and like you can like stick stuff in there too like if you see you want to see my finger can go in there and then you could like close stuff in there you could put like i don't know what you could put in there you could put like a small enough toy car in there you could put like candy in there if you wanted to i don't know what you could put in there you could put a little bit of anything in there but this thing is just really cheap and flimsy and stuff like the way that i made it i made this actually this is custom made tinfoil cardboard I tried to make it a little hinge so it would stay shut better, but that just failed. And I didn't have the right way to make a hinge anyway. But this thing looks pretty cool. I also did some touch-ups. I forgot. I did some touch-ups to the silver here with a silver sharpie. I did some touch-ups there. And I painted that black, black, and this here painted black with sharpies. But, um, oh yeah, I painted the bed too of the truck. And, um, like I super glued all this tinfoil to the bottom, but my new goal with this is um i got some wood so i'm thinking about getting some wood and then cutting it and then hot gluing it in the bed and making a sturdy one and also got a hinge for it too so hopefully that goes well if it does well stupid f-150 i'm just gonna yeah that was it for this video of my 
I think Tough Truck's Ford Bronco with trailer that should have a car, but I don't know what the car what the car looks like. I might, I don't know. Well, um, that was it for this video. Master Rotor Collector out.